are unfortunately phase three results did not show a difference between the combination and the, and the mono arm therapy, uh, and the Vija therapy. And it was not because the combination failed, it was because the control group did very well. We need more data, we need more long-term observations, and we need clinical studies that employ the state-of-the-art imaging to detect and quantify areas of atrophy, also that we do get an answer. Again, taking together what we know as of today, fixed monthly treatment not being an option. The Atlantic study is the first one to include exclusively uh, Caucasian patients. The study is being run in Portugal and Spain, and the enrollment is already closed. What I'm also trying to say here is that it's not just one modality that helps us, but a combination. And here in, uh, in the standard first angiogram still plays an important role early on, and also in patients that don't seem to respond. Because the factor we very often do not think about is the inflammatory component that might be present. And might require, require a completely different approach with the use of systemic medication or local medication to try to control the inflammation. In our part of the world, we see a lot of polypoidal choroidal vasculopathy because we do routine ICGA in every case that comes in with exclusive AMD. So we pick up about 50%, at least, if sometimes even more, of cases actually having polypoidal choroidal vasculopathy. If we will not change our attitude with diabetes, we will be destroyed by the disease. The main uh, improvement that we must try to have is to prevent complications. But whenever complications are already there, we need something which is able to stay uh, inside the eye and to, to, to cure the diabetic complication for as long as possible. Uh, that's because the uh, disease is chronic, complications are for all life long. Exodative disease is baseline diagnostic and it's very yes. important to do a fluorescein and beautiful to have all the characteristics of the neovascular membrane to differentiate between classic group membranes to see red lesions uh, and in cases where we are not sure we may have the ICT and to identify the older lesions which may be treated differently. In India, we actually give them antibiotic drops uh, a day before, and then also on the day of uh, injection, we put a drop of betadine before we take up the patient, clean the eye, and we also drape and give the intravenous there. Renbo is a French study, an observational. A retrospective and prospective study, a four year study about uh, the efficacy and safety of Afibacep LA with AMD patients. We wanted to, uh, we wanted to, to see if Afibacep in real life uh, is uh, efficient and, uh, and safe. Find a therapy for diabetic macular edema with anti agents. Uh, when we follow that patients closely, we give them the right amount of injections and if we need to change therapy, I find it very, very beneficial and very rewarding for the patient and for the physician. I think we are very lucky in uh, our era that we have so many agents available for us at our armamentarium to prevent blindness and improve visual acuity in patients with diabetic macular edema.